Last week, Achilles the cat came to scraps with a dislocated hip and his pelvis dislocated from his spine. Now, staff have him resting here in the crate before they move forward with any further treatment, but they say he's doing okay. He's starting to move around a little bit more and they're optimistic. Good boy. Look who's eating and standing. That's what Scraps posted on its Facebook page today. Just last week, standing was not possible for this friendly neighborhood stray cat. A neighbor found him in an alley near Logan Elementary on Tuesday. Carla Burns says they call him Sylvester and have cared for him for years. He's always been a stray and he knows where the food is, so everybody in our neighborhood, our apartment complex feeds him. The man who brought Sylvester to Scraps reported seeing students torturing the cat outside Logan Elementary. Carla says she does not believe students are to blame for his injuries. This is like really the sweetest. Scraps is still investigating what happened to Sylvester. Director Lindsay Soft says his injuries are more consistent, though, with physical abuse than being hit by a car. She says next week they will take new x-rays of Sylvester to see how he's healing. Good boy. The fact that he's eating and standing on his own is a good sign. He has a long road to recovery. But since we shared his story last week, it's clear Sylvester is not alone in this journey. We've received hundreds of Facebook comments from the Spokane community. Many share their love and support for the neighborhood cat already loved by so many. Amanda Rowley, Creme 2 News.